So we all know breakups can be awkward. Yes. But what happens if your ex owes you money? Mm -hmm. A recent article on GQ broke down how and when you should ask your ex for money. The article says, while it may seem petty to ask for money back on small things, but asking for money on bigger things like owed rent or major trips you were supposed oh, to go God. on. Or moving out. Yes, that is actually reasonable to ask your ex for money. So what's the best way you ladies think to collect your coin after a breakup? Oh, Tisha. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, Tisha, thank you. How fast you want me to leave? How fast you want me to leave? No, no. How fast I, you want me to leave? I oh. agree. No, no, no. <laughs> if that person owes you money or you're trying to get money from them, you do not let them know that you about to break up. You wait to okay. get the money yeah. before well, you break up. See, that's no. why. Once you break up, they have no ties anymore. <laughs> yeah. There's no way to get your money back because they gone. Yeah! And then Tisha? you use... Oh, no. Oh! I'm just joking, I'm just joking. <laughs> no, it's for real, though, it no, is. No, it is. No, that's smart. I don't, what did GQ say as advice? When is the right time? Well, for me, I just know if I don't have the right words or, or to say or I don't know what to do in that moment, I just, I'm just honest. I would just straight up be like, yo, you owe me money. Yeah. And if you don't, well, we can take the easy route or, Ooh. no, yeah, I'll be like, uh... That's tough Tam right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like that. Don't take, don't take, don't take her. It depends on... I like that. I like that. It depends That's on how right. much. I mean, so. she gonna be all 50 cent on you and post about it and stuff, <laughs> you know? It's like... You know, but that's what you do. You, Don't tempt me. Okay. <laughs> I told you. It's like, you know, the thing is, I just, like, straight up. I'm like you, Tim. Yeah. I kind of get rough with lip player. Uh, let me see. You owe me five, carry the one, six, three. <laughs> Stupid. I need it by next Wednesday, or we gonna have some problems. Yes. Oh, but isn't it weird? Honest. Isn't it weird how somebody will get mad at you for asking for your money back? That yeah. is some messed yeah. up. Yep. That Why is, is that? Yeah, how yeah. is that possible? Because people want to act like, you know, they don't want that responsibility, and they want to act like it's not there. And, you know, most of the time, to be honest, if you break up, you're not going to get your money back. So just, yes. just realize that. Just move that. on. Yes. Just move on. Oh. I real, if it's a bad breakup, bye. Keep, I, I'll make the money up somewhere else. Keep your money, It'll and it'll be you. fine. Yeah, <laughs> well, I have That's a friend it, so. who dated somebody who was really successful, and she knew... She, she, he lost his credit card when they are on a trip. So she paid for things. And then he ended up doing some foul stuff, so she broke up with him. But she did pay for some expensive things in the amount of, like, 3000 So Just how did she get money. her money back? So I gave her this advice. So oh, I'm oh, proud no. of it. But it is, it is janky. But I told her because he has so much stuff, and, and he's rich, rich, so taking other things he could buy doesn't matter. But he is an Emmy Award winning person, and I told her to take his Emmy and hold it ransom until she got her money back. And she got her money back. It worked. Now I don't want to know don't who it was. Women. Yeah, don't do that to women. That's not cool. Who no. was it? Can you give us some Ooh. clues? Uh, Emmy Award winning. <laughs> no, I can't. I can't. Ooh. Was it daytime or prime time? <laughs>